Hi and welcome to PyGlide tutorial developed in Python. And now this tutorial is just all about animation, the how to embed an animation into PyGlide. This very one that you guys are looking at was developed using Adobe Animate. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys the steps and the website where I get all the information that I use for the Piglet. And that's all there is to it. In fact, it's going to be a very short tutorial. So let me end this animation there. And right here, guys, these are the lines of code that I use, but I'm going to put another one together for you guys to see but before then here is the animation that I developed in Adobe Animate that is it right there so I then save it went to file export and I just save it as animated GIF that's all I did right so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take you guys straight into Python development environment and we'll put one of these together. But before I do that, I'm going to also show you guys where I get all of this information. I will include this URL on the description area for you guys to have a good look at. There's a lot to read, but you can all, always use the read loud. Uh, read loud device that they have on uh, Microsoft Edge you can always use that so I'm just going to minimize that if you want to use that all you do is click on that and just select read there okay and, and animation can be loaded direct there okay directly from a GIF 89 all right, that's how that works. So you guys get the whole idea. So I'm going to go straight into Python development environment. But before then, you see these lines of code here, this example. So I'm going to copy that. Okay. Copy. I might even include that. Uh, okay, let's copy it and paste that in here. There. I've just pasted that straight in here but one thing that I need to import is I'm going to have to import Pyglet Pyglet okay but make sure this Pyglet is installed on your system else it's not going to work you have to install that on your system let's increase the font size so that you guys can see what I'm up to Let's make that about 16 right there those are the lines of code I've copied so far and all I've only done is just embed or just enter import pipeline now the name of the animation what did I save it as right here is the project file and these are the images I use in making my animation and the one I want is this very one so I'm going to press F2 just to copy that okay copy the name there we go and right here I believe that's the right one let's first of all let me run it and be sure that's the right one double click on it and let's see okay uh, that's the right animation I believe close that so I want to minimize that now right here I'll just paste that animation there okay it's an animated gif okay now one thing is they would like us to enter it in a bin I tried that out it sort of like gave me an error but I then decide to take that out all right so if you guys want to do the same thing the choice is yours delete so that is my animated gif 
is now stored right inside an animation and that animation is assigned to an image this image is then assigned into to pygate class here and stored into the object here now what i'm going to do is i'm going to now come right down here i want to define the the height the width and the height of my animation so i'm going to say this very object that i created here that i assigned all of the image into i'm going to call it sprite or dot the width of my image and i'm going to repeat the same thing exactly the same thing for the height come right down here paste and right here i just change this to height there and let's change this to h there so the next thing i'm going to do is i'm going to now come right here just to specify to make it clear to the window that will run the system that width equals w which is the height here the width here sorry and the height comma equals that okay so the height equals h there okay. i think that's all the rest to it so i'm now going to run it first of all we have to save it though save us just call it dance animate something like that there okay save i actually have the image right here inside my dance folder okay there we go so let's run it and see file run let's see it's coming up there we go guys look at that and that's how you call your own animation use it pilot in python so with that guys i'm gonna call you the end of this tutorial i suppose you guys enjoy it you all have a nice day now. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.